the LG B20 user here, and today I'll be showing you guys rootless Pixel Launcher. Guys, so I got this. I got this from the Play Store. It's for the download. And so, if you guys want to try out this Pixel Launcher, go try it out for yourselves in the description box of this video. Click on that link. I'll take you to the Play Store where you guys can download it and check it out for yourselves and stuff like that. So this is what the launcher looks like here, and as you guys can see here, I have a black background there, as you guys can see there. Um, and you guys see the um, apps at the bottom there, your Google search, and I have a dot on the Play Store. We're going to handle spit, so you guys have your date up here. Click on that, you guys will get preferences, so you guys will get uh, calendar events, upcoming flight information, and traffic information there, if you guys had this checked. Um... And if you guys, uh, and like I said, you gotta see a dot there. If you guys click and hold on the dot, it'll take you. You gotta see the, 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 the notifications there. And you guys can click on the app info, it'll take you to the Play Store app info there, and, and, um, and all that good stuff there. Uh, you press and hold down on the uh, home button, you guys will have the option to have wallpaper, widgets, and home settings there. And if you guys scroll over, you guys will have your installed apps over here. So if you guys install a new app, it will be showing show up over here and also in your app drawer, obviously. So back to this, you guys will have all wallpapers. You guys have the option to choose you know, what type of wallpaper you want. Widgets, this will be your widgets here. You know, self explanatory there. Your home screen settings for the pixel launcher, you guys have the notification dots. Mine are turned on, that time is on. Uh, but they're off by default, but you can turn this on if you want. At a glance, display Google app on the left screen. Display app suggestions at the top of your all apps list. A lot of home screen rotation, you, you can have that on and off. I, I have that off. You have themes and you have icon pack and stuff like that there. So you guys click on the uh, uh, automatic thing. You have automatic default, light, dark, transparent. Automatic is basically this right here, so nothing special about that. Default theme, basically, you'll be like like a light theme there, as you guys can see. Um, that was default. Light is pretty much the same deal there. Dark, basically, you no know, dark theme or whatnot. So this dark theme here, um, transparent theme is this. Uh, so whatever wallpaper you have, it will be transparent onto the uh, app drawer here. And as you guys see here, I have a uh, a black background, so it'll be all black all the way through. Um, and you have icon packs. Which is right here, and I have the system default packs, which is you can download different icon packs and use those if you want. And if you scroll left, you guys will have your Google feed right here. And all that good stuff. So this is your Google feed, nothing to explain about that. Search bar, uh, it will have your five most recent apps and your recent search history there on Google, uh, on Google search. Um, swipe up, y'all guys can do this, you know, and if you, and as you guys see that I have dots on YouTube and look out there, and you guys, if you guys click on the dots, you know, see the, um, uh, the notifications there, um, and then if you guys click on the take to that particular, take to that particular, uh, that particular notification over it. And you guys will notice that uh, most of the uh, apps don't have circle icon shapes. Uh, they, most have, they mostly have the square icon shapes that the app developer hasn't implemented the circle icon shapes. They'll still have the square shapes for your apps. Most of the Google apps have the circle shapes set for YouTube. I don't know why YouTube don't have it. Um, Lookout has it. Madden Overdrive has it. Twitch has it. Um... Uh, ca the calculator has it and stuff like that. Um, 
so yeah um this is a this is a awesome launcher i like it a lot my favorite feature about the launcher is the dots that's my favorite feature about the launch you know what i'm saying so you know great launcher there great feature there uh this is a great launcher um so if you guys want to install this launcher click on the link below It'll take it to the play store install it and follow the prompts because it will ask you to install something else as well and so just follow the prompts to install this thing and you guys should be good to go and so uh yeah that's all pretty much it there on the rootless pixel launcher it's available in the place for free uh no required of course and you guys should check us out it's a great uh launcher it's awesome so uh yeah so yeah if you guys enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up guys it really helps me out a lot peace rate comment subscribe thank you very much for watching my video and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out